Greetings, welcome back. Let's continue on with The Witcher 2. Are we meant to go up? Or are we meant to go here? Oh, we're meant to go here. Let's go see if we can go up then. Locked. All right. There we go. Um, so yeah, I actually mentioned last time that I never played The Witcher 2 and I never played The Witcher 1 even though I own both. Problem is that um, anything we can pick up. Yeah. So I remember buying, I still have it. I have a physical copy of The Witcher 1. Um, I remember at the time when I bought it, I, I remember it being a hassle to get it running. Um, and I was with a friend at the time who was with me at the store and I kind of, I saw The Witcher in the, in the shelves and I showed it to him and I was like, yeah, I'm, I'm kind of interested. I wanted to play this game, but it seems like a hassle to get it to run. I've heard it's kind of, kind of bothersome. And then he looked at the uh, system requirements, which didn't, which, did, uh, which didn't really say all that much to me at the time. I wasn't too um, up with all the uh, PC requirement lingo at the time. And he kind of said, well, yeah, it'll be fine. So I just bought it, and it was the regular edition, not the enhanced edition, which had released at that time. So I kind of knew, well, but I did know that I could uh, just we can repel them! download. I keep forgetting that circle is now casting. Die! Continue my story a bit. Soldier's orders. We've already ra read that one. Let's see if it's still the same. Um, so now my cursor is over here, but I do. There it is. Okay, now we're back here. Uh, yeah, it's soldier's orders. All forces to fall back immediately to defend the routes leading to the temple. These positions must be held at all costs. Death to the tyrant. Yep, same orders still. Um, so yeah, but physical copy of The Witcher 1. I uh, spent a whole lot of time downloading the uh, enhancement patch because it was quite large and internet wasn't really that great at the time. So that took a hell of a long time. Installed it and it it barely read. I don't. It, it was horrid. So, <laughs> yep. So done with it. Done. And that was it for the Witcher one. And when I first bought the Witcher two, it had been out for a while. It was already the enhanced edition, and I had a PC that should be should have been able to run it perfectly well. And it did, but it kind of did did these. Um, I don't know. It, it, it kind of wasn't really chugging. It was just acting weirdly in a way that it was kind of uh, almost kind of doing my graphics card in something like that. It was kind of really almost glitchy in a way so it didn't really ch <laughs> I was like I, I don't want to have this running it doesn't uh, seem like it bodes well for my PC so that's why I stopped playing Witcher 2 uh, but uh, yeah that PC would have been f would have been capable of running it easily because that's the same PC I played the Witcher 3 on later so yeah Which of 
three I actually got. See? Enemy is still showing up on the map. I know he's gone. It's not until the body disappears, I suppose. So we can go here. Well, maybe not. Key required. Alright. No oh, we have to fight a big guy. Save it this time. Best item. Oh, look. It's gyrating. <laughs> uh, hang on. I think I know what I need to do. Uh, yeah. Probably need to head back because now we have the key. Leather gauntlet. Uh, can we equip that? Um, armor plus one. Uh, armor plus one reduction from the um, common epic. That's worse. If we room mage trousers, trousers, so are we just not? Well, we're in our undies, I suppose. Just kind of wondering if so. Yeah, there are different. Um, decals for different armors. That's nice. Uh, no. 
I am not getting this inventory system. I don't know how it's common. I'm wearing mage trousers, which has I think this is what we'll we were wearing. Yeah, no. Coffee. There we go. Hmm. Keeps doing that weird camera thing whenever I go through a uh, a door. You made it through. You have just become the most titled witcher in the world. And the wealthiest. I'll remind you of that when this is all over, sire. See, Vernon? Geralt succeeded. Lucky he did. The priest was downright discourteous and went off to meet his gods. <laughs> I saw Scoia'tael on the river. Where? How many? What colors did they wear? Plow the elves. We'll tend to them later. The monastery awaits. Scoia'tael. This puzzle is beginning to come together, Geralt. You're either telling the truth or weaving a very convincing lie. I want to hear the rest. Foltes bastards. The solar. What happened? Kaiser sorcery. It all started with Silas. We might have arrived at the same time, if not for tales. Tales. Be specific, Witcher. Well, the Archpriest told the truth. His Majesty King Foltest of Temeria. Arthur Tales, erstwhile Count of Nesvelt. I signed your sentence. Yes, yet the Baroness saw fit to pardon me. An awkward situation, to be sure. Anais and Busi. Where are they? The royal children. Don't test my patience, Tails, and I'll grant you a quick death. Confess, Foltest, before the gods and the people. Busi and Anais are the fruit of your loins. Bow to the gods and admit the truth. You may not have noticed, Tails, but I just took this town. Aided by murderers, sorcerers, and a mutant for whom nothing is holy. This is hallowed ground. You will not raise your hand against a servant of the gods. Well, you only have one option. Where have you taken the children? The Solar. They're in the Solar. What is this? Blasphemy! Sorcerer's tricks! <laughs> no, we don't slap him. Quiet down, Tails. This is a church. No, there you go. I'll not forget this, mutant. You hear? Damn, I've seen assaults go awry, but the dragon topples them all. Tops. Tops what? Well, tops all. Damn nonsense. Geralt, you should know. Is it possible to tame a dragon? Not as far as I know. Then why is this reptile eating only mine, then? Let's hope Marigold got out of there. I'm sure she did. If not, you'll need a new advisor, sire. Shut up, Roach. It's possible that the dragon simply... Another word from you and the dragon will not be your main concern. Enough! Both of you! To evade dragon attacks, bless you. Alright. Quick time events, coming up. The dragon's back! <laughs> I can't! You 
saved my life again. Ask what you will of me, Witcher. Within reason, of course. I need to leave, sire. I'd like Triss Marigold to come with me. If she wants. Are you blind? She's enamored with you. You may leave, and none shall stop you. You have my word. Mm. I don't think that'll happen. Goes there. Foltest. I've come for my children. Geralt, wait here. You might scare them. Ah, thanks be to the gods. My prayers are answered. That's not my father. But it is your king, boy. <laughs> Bells, your triumph is complete. The city and fortress taken, sire. Time to thank the forefather and the mother creatrix for this great victory. A moment, blind man. I've not seen my children in six months. The gods can spare another minute. Listen to me. Your mother and I quarreled, but that is over. She was deceived. Evil men turned her against me. These men have been punished, and all will be well from now. No tears, Boosie. One day you'll be king. And kings do not weep. Armed men approach, sire. Children, go to the refectory. My knights will soon be here. You must meet them, for one day you will rule them. Usi, go wash your face. They must not see that you wept. There's a bucket of water in the next room. A nice. Help your brother. Mm -hmm. Oh dear. Sire, let us pray. They must look like the royal children they are. I see a witcher too. He's hiding his eyes. Hmm. They have your eyes, sire. Is that, um, Metho? Goes to paycheck.
It was at B. It was the one on the So, bit of a spoiler for Witcher Three. You get the um, you meet you meet up with Letho Letho again, and then of course you get to choose what you want to do with him. Ah, I suppose that's the extent of what you'll give me. Does this mean I'm free? Voltest, King of Temeria, has been murdered. Unfortunately for you, you're the only suspect. The murderer outsmarted you, so I'm to rot in this dungeon. Oh, no danger of you rotting. You'll hang. Convince them otherwise. I have no influence over the court. Mm hmm. Fault has talked about you. What's happening in the kingdom? Triss will vouch for me. Alright, what's happening in the kingdom? What's the situation in Tamaria? The Council of Regents has convened to restore order. That means three things utter chaos will prevail, the Sema will run dry of wine and strong drink, and the local whores will make a killing. Is Triss participating in the meetings? Indeed. Only to find out that she's no longer needed. How do you know? It's my business to know. They want to run a kingdom without a sorceress? They already have a kingdom without a king. They'll use every opportunity to get rid of her. Who will rule? The chief contenders are Count Maravel and Baron Kimbold, who already tussled for control of Lavalette Castle. What about Foltest's bastards? The king's blood runs in their veins. So yes, they are entitled to the throne. Not some drooling nobles. So yeah, Trish, Trish will vouch for me. Um, I'm guessing Trish does, doesn't really have a lot of clout anymore. Or a lot of sway. Um, oh yeah, the thing about Leto, when you meet up with him again in The Witcher 3. So I, I didn't really know what exactly had happened between Geralt and Leto. Leto. I uh, I kind of got the whole thing that he had slighted you somehow or wronged you in a big way. Um, but since we were up against the wild hunt, I decided to uh, show some mercy as long as she helped us out. Kind of my reasoning. Uh, Foltest talked about you? Foltest told me a lot about you. If not for him, I'd be a drunk or a vagrant. Foltest did more for me than my father ever did. But then my father did exactly nothing before I never even met him. In any case, I'll not rest until the murderer is punished. Tell me how you serve, Vernon. I carry out orders others are incapable of executing. Um. Yeah, it just doesn't help anything to say this. I'm not the murderer. For fuck's sake, you command the blue stripes. Do something. The real murderer is free, and he's further and further away with every hour you spend prancing around in here. I find the killer monk story unconvincing. I don't claim he was a monk. He was wearing a frock, though. He sailed off in a boat with some scoyatel. Would you recognize him? No problem. A mountain of meat. Never seen anyone bigger. What would you do if you escaped? None of your business. I'd hunt down the killer. Um. <laughs> yeah, kind of uh, the thing he wants to hear. And the thing that would be... Hmm. I don't know, none of your business is almost... Eh, I'd hunt down the killer. Sure, let's let's tell him what he wants to hear, I suppose. Uh, he's probably smarter than that, but okay. I'd go after the Kingslayer. You know where to look for him? Some Scoia'tael helped him escape. That's where I'd start. I expect you might know this particular group of elves. How'd you work that out? They wore blue striped masks. Trophies, I expect. 
Your vets, Commander. I know where to find them. We've a trail to follow after all. If you want to start over and take it easy this time, get me some food. Now that you mention it. Vess! He's out there this whole time. Bring us food and drink. A few words. <laughs> Shame you didn't think of that earlier. It's your own fault, Geralt. Your fate is in your hands. Thank you. Never heard of women serving in the special forces. This is one of my best people. How'd she wind up in the Blue Stripes? I pulled her from the paws of the Scoyatel. Just 16 when they torched her village and slaughtered everyone. The unit commander took a liking and spared her. One last thing. This file is about one Geralt of Rivia. And Foltest's death? Actually, Geralt's death. The report details events from five years ago. Rivia. Population 1,234. In that, 253 non-humans. September the 25th, 1268. A riot erupts. A massacre ensues. The streets run with the blood of elves and dwarves. One person finds the courage to face the raging crowd. During the rioting, 76 non-humans perish, including the witches Geralt of Rivia. Stabbed in the chest with a pitchfork by a man of whom we know only that his name was Rob, and he owed three crowns at the local tavern. Yennefer of Engerberg dies trying to heal the witcher. The bodies of Geralt and the sorceress are taken away by a mysterious young girl with ashen hair. Their place of internment remains unknown. I remember. Rivia. Yennefer. What just happened? I saw... I saw my own death. And the rest? Have you regained all your memory? That's all. I just remember the end. Vess! Interrogation's done. Restrain the prisoner. I'll take the key. I sail up river at dawn. Guards will collect you in five minutes. Eat. You'll need your strength. Wait. With, with the arms tied behind my back. Still, yeah. Not yesterday. He was a hero, pretty much. Everyone's man. Personally saw him cut down 20 men in the blink of an eye, so it's no surprise. Hmm. See him dashing along those walls. Can't rightly say I ever saw his sword the blade move so fast. I thought that beast would tear him to bits when it came out the clouds. Delayed don't mean denied. Hangman will do that tomorrow. <laughs> what 
say we um, teach him a lesson or lead it to full test. I'll not touch this gum. I get scurvy. Right. Hangman will do it. He's poxy already. So we need to provoke them to get in here, else we'll be free and still be stuck in a dungeon. Guard. Come here, good man. Why are you hollering? Do that again and we'll shut you up. Just tell him I'm uh, Just tell him you're itchy. Come in here, scratch for me. Um. What's going to happen to me? How long are you going to keep me in here? Can't wait to see the hangman, eh? Don't worry, tomorrow's your big day. I can't wait to see him skinned alive. <laughs> you know, it doesn't hurt to just ask. You could just uh, maybe maybe they'll let me out. You got the wrong guy. You mean you didn't kill Foltest? Nope. Holy shit, boys! Open the cell. We've got an innocent <laughs> man in here. <laughs> Hope you're that funny during the execution tomorrow. Yeah, brave words. You wouldn't say that if these bars weren't here. Is that so? Let's see. Well, that was easy enough. Rip your guts out! What? Yeah! Still going. What's this? Prison key? There we go. Our back has seen better days. What's this? Is that our stuff? No. Uh, small blackjack. Uh, yeah, okay. Yeah. Cat poison. Cat potion. Allows us to see in the dark. Alright. Well, we have a weapon. Nothing in there. No, they let us keep our medallion. That's nice. I seem to have forgotten something. Oh, that's annoying. Now it does that because the. Okay, well, if you just keep walking. Yeah, I don't know what to. Th if there is. Oh, there it is. What is it? What can we do? Set open this whole time. I guess that's. Well, let's get out of here. Damn torches! I can't sneak out in this light. You're in stealth mode. Try to avoid illuminating illuminated areas. Uh, knock out guards by sneaking up behind them and press Y. What was that? Don't 
Nice, Spook. What? Any more? Hello. Hmm. You kind of look like uh, kind of look like Leto, but you don't have to build. Leave me be. Let me alone, please. All right. Don't hurt. Prisoners escaped! Guards! All right, Hodge, Where the hell out. is Let's everyone? Guards! Over here! Throttle idiot! Really? If you wanted a map, there it is. First rate carving. I needed a bit of courage. Had a few drinks beforehand. You were supposed to get caught, but not for thieving. Because for that, they whip you first. How are we supposed to see the corridors among all those scavs? And we said back, not backside. How are we supposed to glance at that thing if you need to drop your trousers every time? Hmm. Don't know what that was about. Quite surprised to see stealth sections, actually. Also, um, um, QTE events, quick time events, we've had those. Don't remember those being in uh, Witcher 3. Shilad Fitz Estelin, emissary of the Empire of Nilfgaard and its most divine emperor, Emir Var Emrys. What do you want of me, Nilfgaardian? Simply to speak, my lady. Ah, really? Something you would not dare were my son still alive. I very much regret the death of the Baron Lavalette. Please accept my deepest condolences. Yet it is precisely his loss that renders our conversation mutually desirable. Let go of me. I shall walk unaided. I shall return, rogue! And I shall repay you. Let us go, my lady. Your cries can do us no good. Fitch. Who is she talking to in here? Damn it. 
thought as much. Cutscene does not mean save. Rage, rage oh. against the dying of the light. Is he going to turn off? Turn on? I'll say, Sergeant, I'd like surface duty. <coughs> What are you, you guys talking about? You deaf or what? I said a prisoner's escaped! Guards! Where the hell is everyone? Guards! Over here! So, where's this prisoner, huh? Ah. You look talking anymore, do you? All right, I'll skip this. So they were going this way. Should we still try to get the hangman? Fucking prick! Fuck you, cocksucker! Fuck you up the ass! Motherfucker! Hmm. I'm gonna fucking kill you, hear me? I'll rip your prick off and beat your head in with it! Okay. I think you can stay in there for a bit.
Heavy trousers, short gauntlets, boots. New journal. Examine. Mary Louise Lavette confession. Do solemnly swear that my children, Anais and Boothy, are the offspring of my eldest son, Arian. Who did sh who did shire them through incestuous union with me? I see they're trying to uh Alright. Hmm. So that's what they're trying to do. So we have boots. Uh, those are the same. Oh, that's a diagram. Action is not allowed. Junk. Boots. Plus one. Has. Sure. Heavy leather trousers. Uh, Yep. Well, we're, we have a bit more armor to go on, to go with. What twine? Any more stuff? Oh, what stuff? Peak? No. Yeah, I gotta remember to save once in a while. So now they gave us another save. Is that a better club than what we have? I think it is. A uh, small black blackjack, five to ten. So this is, yeah, lower damage but higher maximum damage. Yeah, sure. Stealthy now.
Come in, Master Geralt. Allow me to introduce the Baroness Lavalette, mother to the royal children, who at present mourns the passing of her eldest son. A lady. I comfort the Baroness with assurances that House Lavalette needs suffer no more. Its future brighter as it stands protected by the Empire of Nilfgaard. Did you kill my son, Arian? Um... Um, he, he, yeah, he gave me no choice. I offered him the ability to surrender, but he didn't. I had no choice. He knew what can happen once swords are drawn and begin to swing. He chose death over shame. Stubborn like his father and grandfather before him. Honor above all. How did he die? Did he suffer? No. I doubt he felt the final blow. Didn't even see it coming. There's that, I suppose. Um, why, why, why do we need to tell him more? Many perished in this war, not just your son. Well, that's, that's true. Milady, I killed many during the assault, not just your son. War demands sacrifices. You might remember that the next time you're about to start one. Have some compassion, Master Geralt. The Baroness requires support. She is distraught as it is. Unnecessary toil, Excellency, for witches have no feelings. And the truth, especially when painful, can wake us from the slumber of self-deception. I deserved as much. Milady, I wouldn't trust the Ambassador if I were you. Master Geralt, let us be serious, please. Let him speak. I wish to hear this. I didn't know your son, but I know he saw the Empire as a foe, as did King Foltest. You've no notion of the events transpiring in the Kingdom, of what Kimbolt, Maravel, and their ilk are capable. My duty is to Foltest's children, their safety. And though I too see a pact with Nilfgaard as a pact with the devil, I feel I have no choice. Besides, can you say that you really knew the king? Well enough to be confident of my words. Truly? In that case, what kind of a man was he? I wish to know your view. Is... Is, is Geralt kind of looking straight ahead as a sign of respect or is it, it did they just not align the eyes it's kind of weird he looks away from her but then sometimes he will look at her maybe it might be because he's um she well i guess she is nobility so maybe that's why he does it uh let's see he was tough and ruthless a good thing he was like any other man except born to wear a crown i'm not one to judge he used everything and everyone <laughs> yeah, I'm not one to judge, I'm just a witcher, I just get paid. A lady, those of my profession generally live longer by not judging the nobly born, especially crowned heads they're accused of murdering. If there's any truth to the accusation, you stand to lose nothing by speaking. I didn't kill Foltest. What's more, I intend to find the man who did. The ambassador questioned your guilt. It seems now that I, too, believe you did not slay the king. Your Excellency, you will aid the Witcher to escape the castle. That is my wish. But, my lady, this would represent an immeasurable risk in my estimation. And there is the matter of your son. He chose his fate and departed in a manner worthy of the Lavalettes. How am I to believe you'll protect me from reptiles like Kimbolt and Maravel when you balk at the notion of deceiving a few prison guards? Milady, I shall do what is in my power. Give me a moment, Witcher, then proceed to the main gate. I guess we're done speaking here. Search well balanced dagger. Can we equip that? Ranged weapon. Uh, why do I? No. No. Yeah. 
There we go. Okay, so I used the mouse there, even though it's invisible to do. Guards, invisible to use. The witch has fled his cell and is raging in the dungeon. Restrain him immediately. One more word, soldier, and I shall personally make certain you hang beside the fugitive. To the dungeon, on the double. What? Shillard, so we still have to follow it. No, search. Oh, I guess that was to open it up, get us through. Oh, hang on. Sword. There we go. Inventory. That's more like it. Reach the river boat. Halt! Oh, blimey, is that you, Witcher? They say you killed the king. Well, I didn't. And I'm going to prove it. I'm inclined to believe you. Is that Glad to boy? hear that. It'd be pretty stupid if I had to kill you now. Did all the Reavers survive the assault? Aye. They've been drinking themselves silly for two days now. I believe I owe you something. You don't owe me a thing. We wound up in a boiling cauldron during the assault. You know how it is when knights get caught in a tight passage. Nowhere to go. Those in the back push forward. Those in the front are stuck. And halberd blows raining down from above. I'd have been crushed if not for my armor. And about ten blows landed on my helmet. My ears still ring, and I puke time and again. But I live and breathe. Concussion. It'll pass. Let's see. Were you with the Reavers in that... Scoyatel ambush? Were you on patrol with the Reavers when they ran into those Scoyatel? Aye. Kenneth mentioned the unit was especially vicious. Notice anything out of the ordinary? A unit emblem or something? Right you are. They had masks made of the cloth of Special Forces uniforms, and they hollered a lot, Yorveth or some such. Hmm. Where did the dragon come from? I've no idea, but it saved our asses. The elves ceased shooting at the sight of it. Can't tell you anymore, as we fled right then as if the devil himself was on our tail. Take this. Kenneth told me to study up, but I've not the mind for it. Just not cut out to be a dragon hunter, I guess. It could be useful to you, though. I need to go. There are sentries on the dike. No way you'll slip through. Can you distract them? Um, I'll try, but remember, count me out if there's a fight. In fact, we could end up foes. I hope not. Go. Just give me a minute. What did you give us? The Kingslayer's escaped. We need to cut him off. Follow me. All right. Let's go! Cannot save. Uh, hang on, let me check the map. Uh, so we are here. Can I zoom in? Yes. So I'm guessing... Yeah, I have to follow, follow him up there. Save already? No. Geralt, over here. Trish? Oh, there she is. Let me uh, loot these boxes. Sneak out. Avoid anything resembling a bloodbath. 
You left me the key to my manacles, not an invisibility cloak. Triss, is everything all right? Not exactly. I'm no longer the royal advisor. I've lost my post, my home in Vizima. Witcher's mistress, they call me. Kingslayer's whore. Yeah, we'll find a killer. People say what they think they have to. I know, but... They'll change their minds as soon as we find the Kingslayer. Roach will see to that. Right, spy? I'm no spy, but you're mostly correct. An interregnum is chaos by definition. Rats like Baron Kimbolt and Count Maravel rule Temeria now, or strived. But no one save old Natalis can restore true order. Natalis is far away and of low birth. The crown's simply out of his reach. Baron Kimbolt, on the other hand. Politics is secondary right now. Vernon, learn anything new about the Kingslayer? A week ago, I got a message from an informer in Flotsam. He saw Yorveth in the company of a large, bald man, not unlike the one you described. A week ago? Sounds like a cold trail to me. We need to start somewhere. The trading post is a few days upriver, in the forests that lie on the Adernian border. Yorveth's territory. Flotsam it is, then. Triss. Yes? I'm a bit beat up. Will you look at my wounds? Mm-hmm. Let's go below deck. And I need you to tell me about Yennefer in detail. I want to hear it all, even the things you don't want to tell me, even the things that might hurt. Prepare to cast off. Clear the lines and all aboard. Lines clear, Captain. War is a good time to forge friendships, alliances. Harry and Lavalette, busy building walls and forging swords, forgot that. When he was gone, those he loved were forced to forge friendships with those he hated. Life can't be easy for anyone who's unlucky enough to be labeled a regicide. That goes triple for someone like Geralt. Could his luck get any worse? I've known The Witcher for a long time, and I'm sure that kings, courts, and politics concern him about as much as last year's snow. But hey, life doesn't always dole out what we expect, right? Sometimes it even forces us to associate with unsavory characters like Vernon Roach. No, I'm not making any excuses. And yes, I had my reasons. The Witcher spent most of the way to Flotsam talking to someone. Long into the evening, as water lapped against the boat's side, Triss told him forgotten stories of his unexpected child and his toxic relationship with the sorceress named Yennefer. Stories of a life stolen from him. Am I boring you? Don't set this tale aside. Give me just a few minutes more, for someone special's about to appear in dire straits upon a scaffold. Four months? Oh, four months earlier.
sheathe your sword, Elf. I'm here to talk. Bow low. You stand before a head crowned. That of Demavand, King of Edur, by the grace of the gods. Sovereign of the Pontar Valley, and so on. And you are? A friend to non-humans. I have an offer. Speak quickly and to the point. The Arrakis will soon return, and I'd rather know all before then. I can add several more heads to this one. Each crowned. Go on. Fault has to start with. I barely escaped in Edern. I'll need help. Access to your hideouts and maps of your secret trails. And the support of the Scoyatel. I want no gold and have no interest in a killer's fame. Then why do you wish them dead? It's a long story. Your beast nabbed his necker. Time to go. Do we have a deal, Elf? Present day. Plotsam should be just beyond the point. We'll take the beach. Who's we? You and me. Reconnaissance. I'm coming too. You should stay behind. We can't be sure of the reception we'll get. Precisely why I won't let you go alone. Someone's got to look after you. That time of the month. Captain, well done. Ha! All right. You are carrying too much weight. So we cannot run. Something's brewing. Greetings. Come on already. Can we... Maybe we can do something with the Witcher, we're waiting. Just quilted leather. Uh inventory. How much are we carrying? Quite a bit. Uh, so this is plus four. Magical. Let's try it. Let's see how it works. Your witch's ass is gonna have to get wet. Jump! Hang on, I'm carrying too much stuff. Uh, maybe I could uh, drop some stuff. Well, I have to. Uh, these can go. Uh, these is more. Magical epic trousers. Mage trousers. These can go uh, plus one. So these are actually better. Gonna wear those. These can go. Gonna keep that one. Leather jacket. Epic. Common. Blue striped combat jacket. Was it? That, that was the one I was wearing, right? Hmm. So it has more armor, but then again, uh, let's just keep wearing this. This one can go, this one can go. Uh, still carrying too much. Probably want to keep that stuff. About dragons. That weighs nothing. Book. Contain all available knowledge on dragons. Knowledge. You have acquired knowledge about a monster species. Uh -huh. Dragons were once commonplace. Their rule over the continent absolute. Dragon fire was the bane of cities, and dragons' appetites were a constant threat to the first colonizers. Mages stood against these creatures. Witches were created to fight them. Today's dragons are nearly extinct. There are occasional sightings of folk tales and Scott Slyzards. 
but these creatures are to dragons as stray cats are to tigers. Dragons were brought to the brink of extinction by professional hunters like the famed Grinfrit. Grinfrit Reavers. Alchemy ingredients from the dragon's body are among the most expensive and highly sought after by mages. The beast's roasted tail is considered a true delicacy. All right. No items, no items. Take ramp. Uh, these are quest items. They don't weigh anything. Junk, junk, junk. Uh, they are quite heavy, though. Uh, drop. Uh, change. Pretty heavy. Drop. Ooh, only just. Yeah, this thing is very heavy. Let's drop it. There we go. Witcher, we're waiting. Hello. I want to talk to How people. How goes it, Witcher? I'm very sociable. Come on already. Ooh, there's, there's Hello. I just walk when things are quiet. Witcher, we're waiting. Yeah. I'm bored. Well, why don't you come along? Your witch's ass is gonna have to get wet. All right. Jump! Hey, I can't run. Should be able to run. Witcher, we're waiting. Maybe I couldn't. Any news from your secret informer? The port's blocked. Some merchants have been held up for months. What about roads through the forest? Yorveth rules the forest. Uh. Trouble. You coming? Yep. Let's move. Got to remember the save. Where are we? In a forest? Very funny. But who does it belong to? Yorvet, maybe? I know more about the Pontar Valley than you think. For instance, I know that Foltest stole this land from Demavend a few years back. I believe you had a hand in that. Hear that? I smell an elf. Playing a flute, kill him. That's Vernon Roach, Special Forces Commander for the last four years, servant of the Temerian King, responsible for the pacification of the Mahakaman foothills, hunter of elves, murderer of women and children. Twice decorated for valor on the field of back. Yorveth, a regular son of a whore. I've long awaited our meeting. Laid plans, set traps. And now you appear in my forest of your own volition. You aided the man who slew my king. King or beggar, what's the difference? One dwan less. Trish, we need him alive. No any useful spells? Get his attention. I need to focus. I'll try. Climb down and we'll finish this. I await. Ha! <laughs> You're a man without honor, Vernon Roach. An insect I'll not duel, but one that I will crush. Seems like you spout the same old elven drivel. What do you mean, Witcher? I've seen your kind before. Proud and shay, sneaking around forests, helpless yet masking that with acts of increasing cruelty. I helped kill Roach's king. You call that helpless? Or would you call me a terrorist? No one will grant us our freedom, Witcher. We must win it for ourselves. You're just another old elf in a young elf's skin, using clever words to mask an obvious truth. Obvious, you say? This is not about race or freedom, or even vengeance. You're here because someone powerful told you to be. Someone who's using you. 
They may wear a crown, carry a magic wand, or even lead a guild. But be sure of this. It's not about your freedom, your rights, or your ears. Nilfgaard plowed you once. Now someone new does. Am I wrong? Those times are gone. No one will ever use the Square Tala game. Who are you addressing? Me? Yourself? Or the archers in those shrubs? Triss, now! That ought to discourage them. Triss, are you all right? Lovely. Oh, that's not good. You should have charmed the archers. They're coming. Geralt, the spell's still working. Stay close. Triss is spent, so no more butterflies. Let's get the fuck out of here. Back to the boat? There's even more of them that way. We must fight our way towards Flotsam. Yeah. Get your hands off my ass. Who did you hey, think I was? I'm not a flower or one of your commandos. I'm a woman. Yeah. I know. Ah. 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 At least I'll die holding a lovely ass. Not mine. I'll hold the spell. Come on, let's go. Stop you didn't seem to drop anything. Are you all right? Yes. Fine. Oh, 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 oh. What's oh, happening? No! I see where you're through. Where the hell is that trading post? Starting to think we'll make it. Sorry, I'm waiting. Trace. Be quick! Give me a bit more magic. Just a little. Uh... Coming. You're over! Heavy attacks, heavy attacks actually seem to do a lot of damage in this one. Squirrel attack attacking! Alarm! Squirrels! There's a mage among them! Ready yourselves! Oh. I still don't feel like it anymore. You know each other? rather well but he has amnesia i actually took the witcher by surprise when i killed Foltest. fear not elf i know gerald i know his weakness too many spells at once you can die from that see that yeah the Kingslayer and Yorvith. You all in one piece? Who are you? I'm a witcher. Emirvar Emrys, spice merchant. A trader? In spices. Uh-huh. And the woman? My good man, we barely escaped death. Be so kind as to tell us where we might get some rest. We'll explain everything later. Very well. Head for the market square. You might be in time for the execution. Some ne'er-do-wells are going to hang. A dwarf and some bard. There's also an inn and a brothel. Oh yeah, the brothel sounds especially interesting. Take mm -hmm. care now. Spice merchant. Not likely. Did you say that? Squirrels are our very wolves. Yorveth led them. I saw him with my own eyes. Who are these blokes? They're the ones... So we, we keep leveling up. But I've not really... We have five talents, but how do we actually... 
All right. What if I want to select something? Path locked. Path locked. Which are training? So I have to go that way first, I suppose. Regeneration out of combat. Unlocks the ability to throw daggers. Okay, I need this. How do I get something? I can't. Maybe I'm not... Maybe I'm supposed to... Uh, get the ability to do this later? I'd like vitality, I'd like... Uh, I'd like this. Parry blows from all directions. During combat, the ability to redirect arrows. Hardiness, that would be nice. What about Lerido? Where's the commandant of the reading? Quiet woman! Shut it yourself! Welcome! Guzzling ale and lollygagging, that's all the Rido do that. Go to town and watch the execution. Uh, hmm. Wanted, dead or alive, the elf Eorveth. Exceptionally ruthless commander How of the unit of squirrels. I was wondering why people were going on about squirrels. What's this? It is hereby announced that a rich reward has been set for killing Chiron, the hated river beast. Alright. <coughs> oh no! I'm not talking to a freak. Wait a minute. Be off, or I'll call the guards. Flots. I, see you I the think the stew's friend. ready. Why, ah, some hang artist at work. A bunch of non You might want to stir it. I yeah, heard the spy is cowardly. I work You're the material man. man. Think he'll shit himself? I suppose I have seen my share. That spy included. So? Yeah. He'll shit himself without a doubt! I wonder how um, open this game gets. I have no idea. It's been pretty much on rails up until now, but yeah, it's still the start of the game. Non-human district. There is something on the map here. Let's have a look. The whole thing with, um, mm, can't go in yet, the whole thing of course with, oh maybe we can talk to these guys, uh, I think we have to progress further before we can do anything here. Yeah, a bard and a uh, dwarf, that sounds familiar. Zoltan. Dandelion. Boy of four. Just great. What's the plan? We improvise. No killing. We'll take care of this, Triss. Geralt! No Geralt! Over here! Help! Final way to three. Dandelion. And Zoltan. Talk to the guard. Dog catcher. Let's make a save. Try to go up. Dog catcher. Can we talk to you? Step back, white one. What's going on? Wait, 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 wait. What are they going to hang for? They don't look dangerous. The charge is collusion with the Scoyatil. Dandelion and Elven spy. The bard's hanging for debauchery. What? The sentence was he's to hang for debauchery. And a sentence is nothing to scoff at! People, is this injustice as you see it? I've heard enough bunk out of my way. Is this justice as you see it? Uh, maybe, I don't know. I think that... Could we? 
Sweet the minds. Are you serious? Listen here, people. Is profligacy now a punishable offense in the free kingdom of Tamaria, or are we in Nilfgaard? I piss off, freak! Or you'll have me to deal with. Think of the common folk, you're spoiling their fun. Well, a freak he may be, but he speaks true. Debauchery is one of my favorite pastimes, but I don't want a noose placed around my neck for pursuing it. The soldier boys paid us a visit or two, though we didn't have much fun. Away with you, Margo! Go back to your brothel! Time to go? Fine. But hear this, people. He sure liked to parade about, but his willy wouldn't come to attention. Ha! <laughs> Stop the execution. Shut your trap. The thing is to hang, and he will hang. This is a decent town. Whores and witches notwithstanding. Watch your words, guardsman! I don't know witches, but Margot's a decent woman! Shut it, all of you! Or I'll not vouch for what I'll do! Thinks he's tough, showing off his balls. Don't fret, people. I've seen the rot on them. <laughs> I'm warning you for the last time, Margot! You wouldn't hit a lady. You're no lady! Come oh, on up! No he's room for one more deviant! Oh! Damn it. Look here out! Assaulted an officer! <laughs> They're like <laughs> anyway! <laughs> Look here out! Assaulted an officer! <laughs> They're like anyway! Freak! <laughs> Want to square yeah. the others? <laughs> Come on! <laughs> We don't know her. And it looks like we don't get to meet her. Ah. What the hell is going on here? I said, what the arse fuck is going on? Uh, uh, I'd like to re re report. <laughs> Out of my sight, Clover. A few plowing bandits and you can't even hang them. And you, stay calm, hands off your sword. Our scaffold embraces speeches and hangings. Which will it be? Laws on our side are no in trouble. Who are you? Who are you? Are you in command here? Forgive me. Bernard Laredo, commander of Port Flotsam. Yes, I rule this brothel. Uh, the laws on our side? You have no right to hang them. Interesting. Because I'm the law in Flotsam. I take issue with that. Vernon Roach, officer of the king. Well, well. Blue stripes. The non-human hunters. Precisely. Anyone suspected of collaborating with the Scoyatel falls under my jurisdiction. And Dandelion? What's he accused of? He burned down a watchtower. What's your jurisdiction say to that? I thought so. Is that true? It might have looked that way, but I swear it wasn't my fault. I'd rather give you a thief. Relax. I'm joking. I hate thieves. We can That's put on great. another show, bloody and serious this time, mind you, or we can come to an understanding. Meaning? Give me a minute, would you? Listen here. You may have heard rumors of the tragic events that transpired during the siege of Lavalet Castle. Sadly, they are true. King Foltest is dead. It's likely that Scoyatel had a hand in this heinous murder. So you see, none of you can feel safe. 
That is why today, wagons with armaments will roll out into Flotsam streets. I hereby declare a state of emergency. Await orders. Prepare to fight. And ready yourselves to avenge your fallen king. Now disperse. Go to your homes. Dandelion and Zoltan are free or no nice show? Uh, let's just be sure. What about them? They'll not hang for now. Let's say I'm reconsidering their cases. The scaffold's no place for civil conversation. We'll talk at my home. Your friends are free for the time being, but they're not to leave town. Come after dusk. <laughs> I'll be busy till then. There's one more thing. Welcome to Flotsam, Witcher. He seems nice. They were really going to hang us. I, I don't know. I didn't mean to torch that watchtower. Everything's all right, Dandelion. Let's get out of here. Oh, we all. We all you get out. Thank you. Time to hit the tavern. Come on, Dandelion. You need a stiff drink. And while we're at it, I'll tell you an edifying tale of local hypocrisy that conceals lechery neath a veneer of courtesy. Except nothing can hide the stench. Make way for the town watch. They're all going in. Let's have a look at that board. Hmm. A notice board. Might find something interesting here. Notice boards are a good source of information about opportunities for generating uh, additional income. Mark the blue board. Press X. Anyone needs the witch's help? This looks familiar. Contract. Faced with the insolence of bestial menace of the creatures known as Entrocas, and concerned for the people, Commander Bernard Laredo uh, has decided to post a bounty for the extermination of these creatures. The brave soul who permanently rids the area of this filth will receive a generous reward at the hands of Lewis Mutz and will be listed in the town chronicle as a true hero of flotsam louis Merce, town chancellor take that oh they're all contracts uh maybe not all let's see uh naka contract it is hereby announced that command commandant bernard Laredo has posted a generous bounty for the extermination of nakas in these in the vicinity of the trading post those monsters must be eliminated once and for all. Um, the one to accept this jar, job and successfully, successfully complete it will be rewarded with a bolting pouch of orange, and a priest will be paid to conduct prayers in our hero's name for 28 days. Louis Martin. We'll take that. Proclamation of pardon for Dimitri. Let it be known that the bandit Dimitri has repented and asked forgiveness for his heinous deeds. Command Commandant Laredo, known for his mercy, has absolved him from his offenses and accepted Dimitri back into society. Hereby, all arrest warrants and bounties on Dimitri's head are lifted. Troll, troll contract. The authorities seek a brave soul to kill a degenerate troll lurking near the ruined bridge at the Edernian border. The beast may be defeated by any means, just as long as it's defeated. The troll slayer will be generously rewarded. Relevant taxes and levies have already been deducted and receive a credit the gratitude of the terrorized people of Flotsam. Take that. So we can still take it, even though it's not anything. Uh, head a tangle of forest weeds, chin lined with river reeds, flotsam barbers awaits. Barber awaits. Full range of barbershop services on offer, including beard shearing, close shaves, bloodletting, popping and draining of boils, <laughs> and haircuts, all at affordable prices. Teeth extracted by the smith across the way. Come see me in my bookshop. Peruse all tomes while you wait. Um, so I don't actually remember this game having um, this game having barbershops okay so I just wondered if the game opens up a little it seems like it does maybe craftsman shop in right 
We'll continue on next time. Next time I'll, I think I'll go inside here and have a talk with our friends first. And then maybe have a uh, look around the town. Yeah. They're done. Cannot read the sign. Right, very well. That'll be it for now. So thank you for watching and maybe see you next time. Goodbye for now.